Podcast. I am the bastard love child of Jesus and Screech from Saved by the Bell. How's it going? We good? But, uh, the, but the person I look up to most, though, is, uh, is an odd choice, and it's for his confidence and his joy de vivre, and that is the legend that is Barry Scott from the Silla Bang Ads. Uh, I love, it, it, you know the guy, hi, I'm Barry Scott, I like shouting about Silla Bang. I mean, it's just cleaning products. I wish I could be that passionate about things, you know? No, don't get me wrong, I know he'd be very annoying as a friend. You can imagine him turning up on a Sunday morning when you're hungover. Hi, I'm Barry Scott. Like, Jesus, Barry, calm down, would you? I'm in the wars. And by the way, you don't have to say your name every time you talk to me. I've known you since confirmation class. But on the other hand, he'd be an excellent wingman because he'd have the confidence, you know, picking up the chicks in the club, just going, Hi, I'm Barry Scott. I'd like to take you home and use you on kitchen counters, tables, floors, and even in the bathroom. <laughs> Bang, and then I'm gone. <laughs> <laughs> But I, I, I think I do lack a bit of confidence myself, to be honest. Like, I, I, I blame my bashfulness on our Catholic sexual repression. I do. I think Irish people were a little uncomfortable when it comes to sex and that. Like, I, especially when it tries to do like the dirty talk. That maybe it's just me, like the girl, the girly there going, "What do you want me to do for you, Mister Sexy Man?" <laughs> and I be there going, "Just have sex with me, down to the grand, at a girl." That's, <laughs> Or sometimes the girls are just as bad. I'm there with my best moves. Go, I don't know what that move is now, to be honest. <laughs> do, do you like that, the, uh, the, the stuff I'm doing to you there? The chief says something random like, oh, ride me like, like the train to Cork. <laughs> choo, choo. I, 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 tickets, please. I don't know what you're looking for. Uh, I I think it's more awkward though if you can hear sex going on but you're not involved in it. Like I've been, like I've been living in the house shares now for the last couple of years. Oh, I love those nights when the girl who's in the room beside me comes home drunk with her boyfriend, or she's very drunk, her ex-boyfriend, and you can, uh, you can hear them through the drywall whispering sweet nutter like do you have a Johnny, that kind of stuff, you know. <laughs> They'll always turn the radio on, hoping against hope, will drown out the grunts and the groans and the cries of yes and ooh and ooh that's cold. But, uh, but something I have noticed is, right, and look, I don't mean to single out a gender here, but it does seem to be the ladies yard the louder of the two. And ladies, look, I know you're trying to show your appreciation for all of the wonderful, amazing things that us fellas are doing. But for our sake and the sake of everyone else in the house, a simple thumbs up will do fine. That's, <laughs> that's all we're looking for. You know, like just a reassuring glance around every so often. <laughs> so no doing okay, that's... That'll do us, you know. I want to I leave you with a bit of, uh, of advice. Uh, you know, please do drink responsibly. You know, don't spill it. It's expensive, the recession, all that. And uh, but also, you don't want an aggressive hangover in the morning. I get the worst hangovers now. Like, do you ever get so hungover you can feel it in your hair? You're just like, oh, oh like that. Or do you ever get so hungover that you can't even stand your own company? And you're, you're like, oh god, you're a you know. I, you're stumbling around the kitchen like you're Gollum from Lord of the Rings going, ah, oh, did you do that? Tricksy alcohol. <laughs> no, no. Alcohol is your friends. <laughs> you don't have any friends. That's why you drink. <gasps> My head. <gasps> Go away. <laughs> alcohol look after you. We get the paracetamol and we take them. <laughs> Who's that at this hour in the morning? Hi, Barry Scott here. Ah, oh, fuck off, Barry. Ladies and gentlemen, you've been wonderful. My name's Alan Hurley. Have a very good night. Good night. <laughs>